Hey, how's it going everyone? Kane Hunts Taker here and welcome to another unboxing. Today I bring you Legendary Collection for Joey's World and I really like this one because there's so many cards in here that are just awesome because you got ones from Joey, you got one from Mai and there's a few other random cards from uh, back in the day and it's just an overall pretty good box so I've probably bought two of these ones if I remember and then I bought some 15 uh, about 15 loose packs just because they just the cards are so awesome I didn't want to spend fifty dollars just to get I think it's what five booster packs and you get another uh, play mat so it was just to buy I just wanted to buy some single booster packs but for you guys I thought I'd buy another one and do an unboxing of it so let's get to it oh so I think the aim for me because I've already pulled a few of the good cards I just the one I really need for my collection is a Harpy Lady 2, Harpy Lady Dancer, and a Harpy Queen. And I haven't pulled out a Red Eyes yet. I've, the amount of boost, like some of these I've bought, I still yet to pull out a Red Eyes. Get off there. Alrighty, there we go. Let's open them up. Open down mule. So there it is. There's the play mat. I think you've all seen what it looks like, but just for you guys, so. So, I don't think you're going to see it. So you've got Joey, and the Yu Gi Oh logo, and on the other side is that, uh, that new card for the Harpy Ladies. I forget the name. I'm shocking with names. But we don't need to look at that. So then you got the. Yeah, the limited edition cars that you get with it, and you've probably seen them. And I actually want to keep these in the in the wrap because I might sell them on eBay as a pack. And then it's brand new. Look at it, it's still in its wrap. So I'm gonna put that away. So then you get five of the Joey Collection, Legendary Collection Four Joey's World Booster Packs. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. So there we go. I'll line them up. And there we are. So you can see where I was coming from. I bought 15 because they, they're they just awesome, some of the cards you pull out. but And, you know, to spend, what, $40, $50 on a box and you only get five. Because I think I paid about 70 to get 15 of the packs. So that was pretty cool. Alrighty. How lucky do we feel? Red Eyes, Harpy Lady 2. And I'm, if I'm shivering a little bit, Australia's finally lost its heat wave and now we're dead and cold and it's freezing. So we got a trap hole, a good classic, a stone armadillo. Oh, nice, a beast of Talwar. Pity I've already got a few of them. <laughs> and a trade enough, got one of him as well. Um, ultra rare. So that was a nice pull. And a call of the mummy super rare. So what, you get a rare... Uh, ultra rare and a super rare and a secret rare secret rare saber source see that's pretty good i like that card good simple design and mercury the destructor oh nice so that's from Marek's deck i believe and a roulette barrel and a vampire's curse i love this guy i made a deck based on him oh let's separate the rares eh so we got that that So, let's do the secret rare there, the super rare, ultimate rare. Alright, pretty good pulls so far. But they've already got them ones, I'm afraid. So, I'm probably not as excited. Alrighty, so coffin seller. Triangle, oh, triangle ecstasy spark, good for the harpy ladies. Oh, there's a classic flame manipulator. And a Gravekeeper's Priestess, and I've just seen it, Monster Reborn Ultimate Rare. Nice. I haven't actually pulled one of these yet. That's quite a bit. I might put that on my store. So, then we've got Silent Doom, Super Rare. A compulsory eva Evacuation Device, Secret Rare. And a Suzuki Samurai. Or oh, a Sasaka. And a Vom uh, Vom Vom Vampire Genesis. I love this card. I mean, you could probably guess I built a vampire deck and I was just, I was big on vampires at the time. Where's my rare? 
Did I not pull a rare out of that? Oh. Hang on. Where's my ray? There he is. Oh, she. Alrighty. That was a pretty good pull. Monster Reborn. Just a shame it's banned again. I think call it... No, I don't think call it the horns it is. Harpy Girl. A drop off. Chain Destruction. Oh, nice. Horn of Heaven. I've got one, but it's worth a bit. Um, quite a bit of money for that one. I think it's like six or five dollars. Oh, I think there's an error. Oh, I think it's a bit of a misprint. Dang. Oh, well. An elegant egotist. Super rare. Nice. And a secret rare pot of Avaras. Ah, oh, come on. Look at that. Damage right there. I don't think you're going to see it. I've had to turn the autofocus off because my first video uh, it was always out of focus and I think it was a bit irritating. But, oh well. Still good. So, what have we got? And another Vampire Curse. And a Fiber Jar. Whoa. Pretty big card, this one. I used to use it in a lot of the games. And an Injection Fairy Lily. So, we got the Rare. The Ultimate Rare. Or Ultra Rare, I should say. Yeah. No. So, still no red eyes. Harpy Queen or Harpy Dancer. Two packs. To get Hunting Instinct. Ultra Evolution Pill. A Lava Golem, rare. Yes! Finally! Harpy Queen! Oh, excellent. I can put it to my collection. That's, this was I wanted to pull at least one of the ones I wanted, and I'm pretty stoked about that. And look how gorgeous she looks with that. Very pretty. And a red-eyes black chick. And a foolish burial. Marvelant Mech Goki Inn. I can never pronounce that one. And Amazonas Fighter. I believe that was Amazon Fighter originally. I'm not too sure. Oh, nice! And a Goat Guardian! I didn't know that was in here. Oh, excellent. I've always wanted one. I've never actually had a Goat Guardian. So that's pretty cool. So, ultimate, uh, I keep saying ultra and ultimate, so that's a super rare, the secret rare, and the rare is over here, love golem. Alrighty, that was a pretty good pull, that one. Harpy's Queen, excellent. Let's see if we can pull it red eyes. Meteor Destruction, pretty bad. I mean, it's alright, but, you know, Hero of the East. Labyrinth Wall. Man, good card. Still a good card if you manage to play it right. Another Beast of Tawar. An Emperor Iron Wall. Cards cannot be banished. Attack on Titan, that's what it reminds me of. Oh, a Super Red Polymerization! Sweet! Little fact, I want the actual other art, because there's two types of art, and I want the other one for my collection. Dark World Lightning, I already got one. And a Tyranno Infinity. And a miracle Jurassic egg. The miracle of dinosaurs. Okay. So we got that. Ultra super secret. And that's about it. Alrighty, so we did alright today. I think I did a bit, lot better recording this time than my first video. Because I did a, there was a bit of a instant where I thought the cards were fake. And they're not fake, they're real as real can be. So, just going through the rares, the ultras, and the secrets. So, I never really wanted to use Chain Destruction. Just don't know why. Gravekeeper's Priestess. I don't think I've got that one yet. I've got plenty of these, guys. An Emperor Iron Wall. Cards cannot be banished. I wonder if they were inspired by Attack on Titan. Mind you, this probably come out before then. So, I've actually haven't seen Attack on Titan. I prefer to watch it in English dub. It's just me. Excuse me for not talking Japanese. And a Harpy Queen for my collection. Nice. Ah, oh, I didn't pull out a Harpy Lady 2. Tell you what the plan might be. I might buy some loose booster packs and I'll see if I can pull one out. And a Red Eyes. A Horn of Heaven. I think that's about $7. I'm not too sure. So that's going to be going on my stock. I think I've already got one. I think I've got one listed. I'll have to go through it. An ultra rare monster reborn, ultra rare trading, 
good for the if you want to make a blue eyes deck. Oh, oh, I thought that was a misprint. <laughs> Polymerization super rare, not a bad card. Super rare red eyes black chick. I think I've already got one, but oh well, you're still a good card. Super rare elegant egotist. Silent Doom Super Rare. Call of the Mummy, I've got a few of those. Dark World Lightning, Foolish Burial, Pot of Avarice, Compulsory Evacuation. Ugh, evacuation device, I always get that wrong. And a Secret Rare Saber Source. Alrighty, that wasn't too bad. I think we did a lot better, like I said, a lot better than last time. And I think I'm a bit more committed to doing these unboxing now because I've got my. Uh, boxes all packing up and I got my Legend of Blue Eyes boxed uh, a couple days ago so I'll be doing that soon I just hope it's not fake I really because a few people have been uh, caught out with that on their videos where they've pulled out they got fake ones so I'm praying that it's not I really do but anyway if you enjoyed this video give it a like and why not subscribe for more unboxing videos in the future and I've also do my um, a lot of uh, playthroughs, and I also do playthroughs with my twin, Norsey, and he's going to be planning on doing some Vanguard unboxing soon. He just got his uh, his new mic today, so he's pretty stoked about that. And I will, well, before I say I will see you later, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in the next video.